temperature is a parameter that you can access with open source LLMs or any language model, which essentially guide the model on how random their behavior will be. So here's an image from Koya.ai. It essentially shows what the temperature does. So if you increase the temperature, the probability distribution of the softmax output will uh, change. So here you can see this is the original probability distribution and then it's going to increase. So if you increase the temperature, the probabilities will increase. And this means that when the uh, language model samples from the output, it might not always sample this, which is the top output, but it might uh, sample from the other outputs which are not having that big of an output uh, probability. So, uh, and similarly, there are other parameters known as top K and top P. They also function similarly to the temperature parameter. The lower it is, the more likely that your language model is going to sample the top output, which is also called the uh, greedy approach. And uh, the higher the output is, the more likely that they will sample from an output which is not the top output of the language model. So let's take an example. So what do you expect the output of this sentence to be? The cat sat on the dash. I think most of us will think mat, followed by other things like floor, porch, even car, or something like that, but not sky, right? You can't sit on the sky. So suppose we feed this to a text generation model and the soft max probability just looks like this. These are all the tokens that there are for the model to consider. You have mat with 0.6, floor with 0.2, porch with 0.1, car with uh, 0.05, bus 0.03, and sky with 0.02. So if you set the temperature is equal to zero, and your top k is like two, and your top p is like 0.1, then the most likely completion of the sentence will be the cat sat on the mat. But if you set temperature equal to one, and if you increase the other parameters as well, then the then the output might be the cat sat on the sky. So uh, depending on what your use case is, the temperature parameter could be useful. Uh, setting it high could be even useful. Uh, that is entirely up, uh, up for you to decide. So we'll be walking through uh, working examples. I've already loaded these libraries. The link to this Colab notebook will be in the description. Uh, you need to import the Hugging Face Hub. Uh, you can use any other language model. I'm going with Llama 2B, uh, Llama 2 7 billion, uh, loading it in the quantized format of 4-bit. Uh, this is just the system prompt. We uh, see the create pipeline here. And uh, and we uh, have the create pipeline here. Here we have the uh, different parameters that you can play around with. So this is temperature, top P, top K, and uh, maxing tokens 5 and 2, you can leave it as it is. And we have the text generation pipeline. So we see when we put as temperature is equal to 0.1 and the rest is very low and we see the completion of the sentence, the cat sat on the, the language model also gives us the same output that we expect it to give, which is the cat sat on the mat. But let's see that if we uh, uh, tweak the pipeline to make the temperatures 0.A, the top P is only 50%, the top K is only the 10 token, the most likely 10 tokens. Then also the language models give us in this case, it gave us the cat sat on the mat. Uh, if I run this again, let's see if the output changes. It should not change too much, but like I said, the cat sat on the mat. But what if you give it a temperature of one, the raw P is 90%, right? The top K is 100. So the last time I ran it, it gave the output the cat sat on the windowsill, which is an unlikely candidate, but we can run this again and see what the model gives it back again. So in this case, it gives the cat sat on the mat. I can give it a stop nine nine, and then as like ten thousand. And let's see what it gives us this time. It gives window seal back again. So the uh, essentially uh, maybe Llama is not the best model to showcase the randomness in the language models. But if you want the text generation to become more random, you increase the temperature, you increase top P, and you increase top K. But if you want it to be less random, you decrease those values. All right. Thanks for watching.